What's good? What's good? This is Stinko. This is Stinko the podcast. Hey, do me a favor right now. Stop wasting your time. Subscribe to the channel. See the who's still looking me to press like. Share this video on all your social media platforms. Drop a comment in the comment section. I'm always in the acting with me. Hint to side. Hit the notification bell to get notified. Visit the website r2drec.com. Purchase your merchandise. And hey, wait, wait, man. Let me ask y'all something, man. Y'all been in a relationship for a while, right? You and your wife husband and wife, you're doing good. You're the provider of the family. You're the protector. You're building the foundation, making sure it's solid. Y'all got beautiful kids, white picket fence. Y'all got some cars. Y'all got some puppies. Y'all doing, y'all living the best life. Y'all doing it good, you know? And then, you know, your wife, for some reason, wants to get a little bit more attention some way or fashion or form. She's posting on Instagram. She posts on social media. She look like she's single right now, bro. She look like she, she, she looking for somebody. I don't know what she's looking for, cause it like like I remember going to church one time, fellas. I remember going to church. The preacher man said, "The grass ain't always green on the other side." And if you feel like it is, how about you start watering your grass? And I was like, "Man, that's perfect sense, ain't it?" Take care of your grass, but what happens when you take care of your grass and she still feels like it's not enough? Que haces? Que lo que va a pasar? Que lo que tengo que hacer? Like, no estoy siendo suficiente. I'm not doing enough. I built this with these hands. And you still... Look, 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 look. Stephen Curry, man. The Mason three-point shot. Man, from now on, that's a four-point shot. I don't, I don't care what y'all think. The man shooting half-court shots. Ain't nobody guarding nobody in half-court shots. He just making them freely out there. He changed the dynamic of basketball. So I didn't see a video with these young middle school kids shooting back and forth. And they're not nowhere near the three-point line. I'm like, what is going on? And it happens every once in a while, right? New generations come in. When Jordan was around, he was out there with the, ah, with the tongue, you know, changed the air, the airflow. Then you got Kobe with that focus, right? He was, he was just focused and ready to go in attack mode. He was doing his thing with Kobe's brand. Then you got LeBron James, you know, Mr. Flop. You know, he flops every time he gets a chance. That's the only way he, we, that, that's the only thing I know about LeBron. He never entered the slam dunk contest. All he does is flop. Then you got the chef, Chef Curry in the mix. You know, three point shots, baby. But man, that, that dude right there changed the game. I mean, Under Armour, come on now. Who would have thought Under Armour would have been it? I, you know, I got me a little few things saying that. We're we, 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 we not talking about that, man. We're talking about his wife. Respectfully, though. I don't want to get disrespectful. I don't want, don't do it, don't do it, no, no, don't do it. But man, we gotta talk about this, man. A lot of people trying to like, you know, underplay, like it ain't that serious, but it is, yo, it is. You know why? Because when you got celebrities in front, like, I don't know what you're gonna say, you ain't none of your business, bro, you know, they're doing them, you know, you always talk about, no, it is, you know why? Because a lot of people think this is normal. You know how many women say, yeah, that's the way it's supposed to be, you know? My man's supposed to be jealous, and look, they, they always do the comparison. But Curry's wife is, is cool with it and they cool. No, 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 no. No trabaja así. So she's on this one one show, The Bootleg View. You know, The Real. You know what it is. No disrespect. No disrespect. But she's on there, right? This guy with no shirt delivers some drinks. Yes, the She's trying to take off a wedding ring, trying to play it off and trying to be funny. What's funny about that? When you respect your man, what are you doing on national TV and doing babosadas, pendejadas? What are we doing? If you respect your man that much. And see, this is, this, this is the thing. Money, money is not going to change anything, as you could tell. This woman probably got so many things that she needs, wants, or whatever. She has it all. We're talking about Curry right here, you know? Mr. Three-point shot, Mr. Four-point, whatever. He's the man. And Golden State Warriors, they, they, you, you know what I'm saying. And she still got the audacity to put herself out there like, oh, you know, it's just a joke pretty much. What well, was a couple years ago? Because, you know, Stephen Curry, you know, he gets the attention, you know, because he's, a, he's a, a, a Hall of Famer in the making, a future Hall of Famer. And he gets that kind of attention, right? So when he's getting this kind of attention, then it's well deserved. I mean, he's an alumni. He's he he is that guy. He is that person. So 
she's out there talking about, I wish I got that kind of attention from men. Why? Why do you need attention like that? Don't you have a man? You know how many women were killed to be in that position you're in? And they'll probably just be cool with playing the background? LeBron James' wife, you know what I mean? Come on, I don't, I don't even know her name. I haven't. I really haven't seen her like that. She ain't all up in the front. Why? She don't need to be. She don't need to be. And look, I, look, I know what you're going to say, man. I know it. I know y'all probably going to crucify me with this. I'm talking about, man. See, that's what insecure men. And they, they, nah, it ain't about being insecure. It's called about respect. Be respectful to the man you with. Y'all decided to tie the knot. Y'all decided to have kids. Y'all decided to move in together, build foundation. And what are you looking for? There's nothing in the streets out here for you, baby. Ain't nothing out here in the streets for you. Nothing that's worth talking about. What you want to do is just to bust it and that's it? I mean, if that's what you want, that's what you want. Just say that. Just come out and say, hey, look, man, I just want my back broken by another dude. That's all you got to say, baby. And you know what I mean? That's what it is. And maybe you give Curry a chance to say, hey, you know what? I'm going to do me and you do you. And if that's the case, then go your separate ways. I just don't get it, man. Because when you look at Steph Curry, right, there was a few times he brought his kids to the press conference. And from what we look at, he ain't the, 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 the street. He doesn't give you that street vibe. Like a John Morant, you know what I'm saying? He don't give you that. He don't give you that. He don't give you the LeBron vibe. He gives you like a, like just a, a clean cut person doing his best, trying to be great. And just, he, he ain't trying to be all up in the limelight. He's just doing what he's supposed to do, provide as a man. But sometimes I always wonder, women, is that not enough for y'all? Is that not enough? Is that, is, that, is that not what you want? You still seeking for some kind of approval, some kind of attention? For what reasons? Who knows? Because at that moment, I'm thinking, if that's the direction that we're leading towards in the next couple of years coming up, because it's getting, it's getting out of hand. Let's just be real. People are not getting married as much. Celebrities are playing around with marriage. And... And the sad thing about it, the reason why I talk about it, because we act like it's normal. I mean, me growing up, watching my parents be together over 20 plus years, they, they had their moments with nothing, you know, things weren't lining up. But not once, not once did I ever, ever see my mom raise her voice, cuss my dad out, disrespect to him. You know what my mom used to do when my dad got out of line and they hurt my dad so bad? She gave him the silent treatment. She was like, you know what? All right. You can have that. And then when he was like, hey, what's for dinner? She be like, I don't know. Go ahead, make you some food. My dad looked at her like, whoa, whoa, wait a minute. What's going on here? Hey, do you need something from the store? I don't know. How about you look at the fridge? You know when, when the, a woman gives you that and the man is just trying to figure out, okay, how can I get it like back to normal? Back to what we were. Boy, you know what my dad did? He apologized like a man, as he should, because he probably messed up and realized what he did was wrong. And this is a different, it's a difference back then. The social media is getting to these women's head, and even men too. I'm not. I'm not just gonna just like just. But we're talking about her right now. But this attention that they're seeking for, I don't. I don't get it. There's nothing. Like I said, there's nothing in the streets for you, mama. There's nothing. Live your life. Enjoy your life, because you're one of the few, one of the very few that get to live that luxury lifestyle. I don't know, man. Oh, so, look, what do y'all think? Do you think that what she did was wrong or you think that, you know, it was jokey jokes? Or, or do we even joke about stuff like that? Because it's almost like he gave her an inch and she took a mile. Like, literally, not too long ago, she was talking about I need attention from other, other men. 
now that dude comes out with no shirt, he talk him like she just saw something so amazing, a guy with no shirt. Oh, really? I don't know. I don't know. Y'all let me know what y'all think, man. But do me a favor. Subscribe to the channel. If you look at me, press like. Share this video on all your social media platforms. Drop a comment in the comment section. I'm always interacting with me. Hit the other side. Hit the notification bell to get notified. Visit the website, r2drec.com. And always remember, have peace in your heart. Have faith. And never give up. All right. One.